Hey guys, Dale Ross here with Roadrunner Scooters. We have something we're so excited to announce. And finally we have, um, this has been over two years. We have the, the first scooter, uh, Roadrunner branded scooter that we've been talking about. It's finally come to fruition and this is it. It's got some phenomenal features on it. Things that I've been hearing for three years now. Um, and then listen to all the customer feedback, everything into one scooter. This is it. So we're really excited about it. And we think that you guys will be too. Things like, uh, you know, how many times have you gotten on a scooter and, and most of them are like this, the display. You, you, you turn the scooter on and, you know, it's a nice sunny day. You can't see squat. This display took us about six months to find. It is bright, bright with direct sunlight. You will not miss anything on it. All of our RS5s, Tubeless tires, guys. Tubeless tires. There's no more, you know, flat tires and having to get an inner tube is the thing of the past. It's, uh, it's a dream come true. <laughs> We've been waiting for this. Um, there's very, very few tubeless tires out there on scooters, and this is one that I think you guys are really going to like. This scooter, and all of our scooters, by the way, will have hydraulic brakes, okay? Standard. There will be no mechanical brakes on our scooters. They're all disc brakes, okay? They're all disc brakes, but you have a mechanical disc, which is... Uh, basically a steel cable, when you pull the lever, it's a steel cable that goes down and controls the caliper. You'll see the steel cable hanging out the back, like a bicycle. Or you have the hydraulic disc brake. These are hydraulic disc brakes pulling on mineral oil, okay? So when you pull the lever, you're pulling on liquid. It's smooth, right? So not only is it hydraulic disc brake, it's NUT, N-U-T-T. -T. The NUT brand is the premier brand in this industry. And if you know the brakes, you know this is the case. The next thing is, is the clean lines on this scooter. There's no eco, uh, eco mode and turbo mode. That feature's gone. We do have a dual and single mode for the motors, but uh, as far as eco and turbo, it's gone. So on this uh, scooter, you've got uh, phenomenal lighting. It's got two eagle eye lights down low, and you've got the headlights. So you've got three lights coming at you. It's got the side running lights, and it's got the really cool blinkers that showcase on the whole side of the scooter. It's all about safety. You're gonna have a stem that is amazingly, um, it's just so solid. I mean, this, this stem on this thing, you're not gonna get any wobble. Uh, you're not gonna get any vibration. Uh, this I can assure you of, it's a 45 mile an hour scooter. The speed is there, takeoff speed is phenomenal. We're gonna introduce, as the, I can tell you right now, the first company, the first scooter that's gonna be able to introduce a removable battery. We all know that anywhere, anytime you have to charge your scooter, you have to take the scooter wherever your charging area is, like where your plug-in is, and you, know, you can't separate the two, the battery and the scooter. They have to be together. This one will be the first of its kind in a 52 volt battery that you can actually separate the two. And how do you do that? First of all, the deck lid, okay, no more screws are on the edge. You know, typically speaking, when you have to get inside the deck lid, you have to pull up the grip tape. There's gonna be typically 10 screws along the edge. Zing, 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 you know, get all these screws out, and then you can pull the deck lid off. This one has got a combo lock. You put your combination in, you pull the deck lid up, okay? And we all know inside what that can look like. I don't want spaghetti inside when I open my deck lid. I don't know about you guys. This one, there's no spaghetti. It is one simple connection, okay? You pop, and then guess what? Battery comes out, okay? You can take this inside the house, and you can leave the scooter you know, in a safe spot elsewhere. Uh, so you can separate the two, like I said, and it's got two charging ports on it. So you can charge this you know, inside the house, on the charger, while you sleep. Uh, next morning you wake up, uh, you wanna go to work or what have you, you just come back to the scooter, and I must say, real quick, this scooter has serial numbers, not just, stamp, they're stamped serial numbers. They're not just like uh, letters that are, you know, pasted on. They're stamped inside the metal on both underneath the battery and outside uh, on the actual uh, swing arm. Battery back in. It's one connection, so it makes it really easy. And you just wanna go, and you're in. The thing is, is this has sine wave technology. Sine wave technology is the, it's the new, greatest, and best technology in the industry. What it basically is, is when you pull back on uh, the throttle, it's not a jerk. It is a smooth transition uh, to speed. 
um, from the stop to start. So you've got that, and it's extremely quiet. Like you cannot hear the scooter when it's going. So that is sound wave technology. It's got one controller as opposed to two. So less room and lighter. And there you have it. It is a lot packed in here. A great price point. I mean, a great looking scooter. And it rides so smooth. Hopefully you guys will be excited as we are. And uh, we look forward to uh, uh, hopefully you riding a Roadrunner scooter.